are learning new details in a Chesapeake shooting that killed an 18 year old man. Chesapeake police say they pulled over two 18 year olds driving a car last Thursday after getting a call about hearing gunshots inside of a home on Candlelight Drive. Officers say they found 18 year old Stanford Sharp dead in the back seat of the car. And now we're finding out what led up to that shooting. Ann Sparacco reports. These newly filed court documents detail the moment Chesapeake police officers pulled over the two 18 year olds driving with Stanford Sharp in the backseat, including what one of the teens said happened that Thursday night. Chesapeake police say it started with a 911 call from a neighbor on Candlelight Drive who said they heard a gunshot and saw two people carrying someone into a red Ford Thursday night. Court records say officers found blood inside the home trailing from the front door to the driveway. That's when detectives say they got a call about a red Ford driving on North Battlefield Boulevard. After a few attempts, officers finally pulled the car over at Chesapeake Regional Medical Center. They say they found 18 year old Stanford Sharp dead in the back seat after getting shot. The two others in the car were 18 year olds Jason Brown and Dylan Albert. Detectives say Brown wouldn't talk without an attorney, but Alpert gave police officers on the scene a statement about playing with a gun. But investigators say they didn't find a gun inside the car or the home. Instead, they say Brown's brother brought the 9mm handgun into the police station later, saying Brown handed it to him in a bag before trying to rush Sharp to the hospital. Officers say Sharp died before the teens made it to the Chesapeake Regional Medical Center. Brown and Albert now face multiple charges, including reckless use of a gun and obstruction of justice. In Chesapeake, I'm Ann Sparacco for 13 News Now. Now, Dylan Albert has a bond hearing this Friday morning in Chesapeake General District Court. Jay Sean Brown is scheduled in court on March 22nd.